All right, what's going on, guys? We're back again with another VIP on the channel, and today we are back with another Dragon Ball Legends video. And today we're gonna be doing something a little bit different. We're actually gonna be summoning on this banner here. I just decided why not to record it. The banner itself, in terms of the units and all this stuff, it's not really anything too spectacular. I mean, yeah, you have some LFs and stuff, but they're older LFs at this point, as well as a lot of just the normal sparkings of age. I mean, you have units like Zamazu now have gotten a Zenkai, it's really good, but the banner itself is definitely really not the greatest, but the Z power that you can get from here is really good. So obviously we're going to be summoning on here. Uh, main thing I'm doing this video for is just, I just want to kind of just sit here and just talk a little bit about stuff as you know while we summon and stuff i don't know i just thought about recording these summons just because why not i guess but yeah by the way the goal of me summoning on this banner in terms of who i'm going to use the z power on uh the normal sparking z power the 1000 z uh z power that you get i'm probably gonna give to bird coup actually uh the new cooler movie revenge goku uh, this goku right here uh, to actually get him to nine stars because that's pretty much that was actually kind of a goal of mine just to get him to nine stars because i feel like at that point he could actually look pretty solid and all that stuff. His stats will be quite better, as well as the LF multi Z power that you get on the last step. I guess I can start summoning now as I talk. The LF multi Z power that you get at the end, uh, I'm planning to give it to LF Cell. Because LF Cell, I still don't have a six stars. I've been summoning his banner and stuff, but I uh, still don't have the boy at six stars, so there's that. But uh, obviously, with this, I will guarantee get him to six stars and all that. And honestly, I'll probably do a video on him literally right after I record this one, so there's that. But I guess we can just skip this one, whatever. But uh, yeah, but there's that. But uh, obviously, I've been saving for Legends Festival. I know I don't really have that many crystals. I mean, I have 5.1 thousand, I guess, is nice. Uh, oh, I can use it now. I'll, I'll use it later. I'll save it for the end, and we'll just go through all of it. Uh, and give it to the characters and stuff but um yeah i've been saving for legends festival and all of that uh, trust me if i wanted to i could have just been summoning on cell and maybe i could have gotten six stars by then but oh wait a minute um probably then i decided to save and all that i know cell is worth it like cell is really good and stuff but uh i just decided to start saving which i definitely would say is probably smart on my part because that cell banner for me is it's been okay it's definitely not been the greatest or anything but yeah but in terms of legends festival um, I'm definitely quite excited for it. Definitely let me know what you guys think we're going to be getting for Legends Festival. I've, I've mainly been seeing a lot of people, oh, we actually got a spark and let's go. Uh, it's right, so I don't really care, unfortunately, but yeah. But yeah, I've been seeing quite a lot of people, you know, mainly speculate a lot of the same characters like Master Ultra Instinct Goku, Full Power Jiren, and again, the same animation, what the heck? <laughs> um, even like Sword of Hope Trunks now, especially since we uh, got the recent Zenkai of, uh, the Fuse Amazu as well as the free-to-play Goku Black and all stuff. It could happen. It definitely could happen. At this point, I, I'm, I would make a prediction video in terms of at least what I would want to see from the uh, the celebration and stuff, but I don't really know. Like, may Maybe I will probably make that video, but if I do plan to do it, I'll probably wait until a, maybe at least a little longer until like a, we're like right around like until like maybe like next week or something maybe to see if we get some more potential evidence or whatever to what units we could potentially be seeing and stuff but uh yeah there's that i guess i should just be speeding through these summons to be honest because yeah like i said this banner is not really the absolute like best in terms of just the units on and the rates and stuff but again you're mainly the main value of this banner is coming from the z power that you get uh, as a bonus for each summon and stuff, so there's that. We're just gonna skip the animation and let's just, I don't know, let this play out, I guess. Uh, I don't know, it's definitely gonna be quite a short video, but again, I just wanted to record this just because why not sparking? I'll take the 21. I, I, I can actually still use that uh, purple 21 for sure. Uh, I was about to say, oh, I could use the green one too, but uh, she's not even on the banner. Actually, I'll take the nine stars as well. There's that. That's pretty cool, actually. But yeah, definitely looking to forward to uh, Legends Festival as well as uh, the end of the new year. All, all the stuff that's going to happen. Definitely looking forward to it. Definitely expecting uh, a lot. Definitely expect a lot of content coming from me, you know, in terms of showcases, maybe even. Uh, tier list videos just stuff like that, you know, definitely expect Content and all that stuff coming for legends festival and also yeah, I haven't said it if you enjoy ah! what the heck Who was that? Oh, oh, <laughs> that's this freeze. I was like, wait, did I just get LF Frieza? But no, oh my god. <laughs> I have not seen that free. Damn, I got him seven stars just now wow. <laughs> Okay, wow uh, 
Anyways, uh, if you guys are enjoying the video, I know this video isn't really anything too crazy, but regardless, if you enjoy it, you know, leave a like down below. Also, subscribe. That's the main thing I should be saying. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you enjoy my content and want to stick around and all that stuff. We're on the road to hit 100 subs by the year. I definitely do believe we can hit it, uh, especially with Legend stuff still coming up and all that stuff, you know, potentially getting, you know, newer view new viewers coming to the channel and all that stuff. I do believe we can actually hit 100 subs by the year, so... There's that, yeah, that last multi was dead. But hey, at least I got that. Yeah, this this thing right here on the screen was worth it, all right? It was worth all those trash summons, all right? Now we're gonna quickly use the Z power real quick, so I will be back. Also, I hate the fact that they just made it so you can only access the gift box one way. Like, you actually have to come back to the home screen to access and stuff, because like when you press the menu button, there used to be a button like up here and stuff, but they just completely removed it, and now you can only access it here, which is definitely quite annoying, but... I mean, it is what it is. It's still quite annoying that you can't hold, like, more than one of each of these Z-Powers and stuff. I I, I kind of get why they did it, obviously, because they don't want people to be saving too much Z-Power and stuff, you know, so that way, when a new unit comes out, they don't immediately, like, I don't know, like, 14 star them or getting, like, super high stars the second they come out. I mean, honestly... Uh, to me, I find that pointless because you want to get... Uh, nowadays, you pretty much have to get units, you know, to, like, super high stars for them to be viable a lot of times in PvP, so I mean... I don't know, it is what it is, but here we are, let's just quickly give these last bit of, uh, this last bit of Z-Power to Birdku here. Uh, should get him to 9 stars, let's go. Alright, let us scroll down here. Tap on the boy, and there we go. He is nine stars. So I'll probably do another video on him, by the way. Uh, I don't know what team. I'll, I'll probably do it on movies again. Just it might be a video where I just kind of just chill and just play some, just play some PVP with a movie team, and I'll just have some fun and all that stuff. So there's that. Let's look at his stats. Yeah, those stats are definitely looking more respectable. His defenses are 158k to both, so more, much more closer to around the 160k range, as well as. His, Often stats are definitely not the craziest, but definitely looking uh, quite a bit more respectable. So there's that. So definitely looking forward to using him now. All right, now we have this. So now we we are here to give the boy Cell uh, his LFC power and truly make him the perfect being he really is. So here we go. Let's go. Look at that boy. Woo! Look at him. Look at him go, man. Let's go. Alright. We're gonna, we're gonna watch the whole animation. Whew. Look at that power. Let's go. 30% to tag regen, tag android, and tag powerful opponent based strike attack and defense during battle. There we go. Finally got my boy's cell up to six stars. I'm definitely quite excited about that. So like I said, I definitely expect another video on him. I'll probably record it today, and I don't know if I'll put it up today as well, but I don't know, but at the very least I'll try and record and stuff, but there's that, but anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, like I said earlier, we're on the road to hit 100 subs by the year, so if you enjoy my content and want to stick around, definitely do consider hitting that subscribe button, it would really appreciate it. And also follow my Twitter link down below, at 3 and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace out, have a great one, y'all.